friendly pitch from Shaka Shakur. Uh, from Shaka Bottom to Gabriel to the Republic of Africa. The Gabriel Rebellion, although betrayed and disrupted, it represented a significant stage in the ongoing resistance and struggle by African and New African people to be free and independent. In fact, Gabriel was carrying on a tradition by African slash New African people that began as soon as the first colonizer set foot on the shores of Africa and began to kidnap, rape, and pillage. This conspiracy to resist, to organize, to fight back began with a scream, a shout, a whisper, and even that of the beat and rhythm of a drum. From the belly of the beast, from the holes of the slave ships to the sails and cages of America's prison. From the shock on bottom to the rose line to the liberated territory of the Maroons, we began to organize and resist. The identifying of our tribes and nations and the language we speak, and seeking out others to learn and teach, establish the lines of communication. The breaking down and through superficial breaking down and through superficial barriers and differences. These were the building blocks of the New African nation and its historical development. These were the first bricks laid and established not only the New African independence movement, but the very essence of the New African national liberation movement and struggle. From Gabriel to the Arabic, to the Attica Rebellion to the rebellions of fire the next time, after the vicious murders of George Floyd, Breonna Taylor, and so many others. The drum beat continues. Can you hear the heartbeat and rhythm from the spirit of our ancestors? Until we as a people are free and exercising the right to choose and control our own destiny, the right to have to, the right to not have a nationality imposed upon us for a second class citizenship, the right to not to be amended into a constitution, the right to control our own means of production and choose our own mode of production and political system. Until we have land and are able to build institutions on that land to meet our collective needs. Until we can declare ourselves free and independent of U.S. imperialism and neocolonialism, we shall continue to create, organize, and imitate the successful launch of Gabriel's rebellion until it leads to a full-fledged revolution. We shall complete the mission from one generation to the next. Free Haiti, free Africa, free Palestine, Shaka Shakur, New African political prisoner.